So her question is, the Imam does not give a sufficient pause between the Fatiha and the Surah for us to read the Fatiha. First of all, there isn't such a pause, neither in mandatory prayers, nor in Taraweeh, nor in any other prayer. The Prophet ﷺ never paused as the, some of the Imams do, leaving time for the people to recite the Fatiha. The Prophet would only pause to take his breath so that he could go on for the second uh, uh, surah. So therefore, this is not part of the sunnah to pause. Secondly, if you started reciting the Fatiha, and what is the ruling on reciting the Fatiha in the congregational prayer where the Imam is reading uh, his uh, prayer aloud, as in the first and second rak'ah of Maghrib Isha, and as of the two rak'ahs of Fajr. What's the ruling on me reciting the Fatiha behind the Imam? It's an issue of dispute, the most authentic opinion. And this is the opinion of Imam Malik, may Allah have mercy on his soul. And this is what all the evidences go down to, if you want to look at them as a whole. And this is the choice of Sheikh Islam bin Taymiyyah, may Allah have mercy on his soul. So, you know, if you did start reciting it, and he started reciting the surah, it is permissible for you to quickly